Korean grammar for speaking two. What we're gonna study today is Don Deo. Don Deo. Wow. Don Deo. Alright, speaking of this Don, that usually it means like past. I can't say it's like hundred percent past, but usually past. It's about past. And tail, I don't know what that means. So let's just figure it out. Some other books, other teachers maybe, they explain like, oh, this is something about what you experienced and after you experienced, and you want to tell about this experience to some other people. But no, that's too difficult. I mean, it's understandable, not for me. I would say this as, I have done it, but it was blah, blah. This is tondeo. I've done it and it was, I've done something, and it was difficult. I've done something and it was easy. Something like this. All right, let's figure this out. Nouns, adjectives, verbs, don't worry about them because even in English, you can say uh, something that makes English that makes English in Korean too. So let's figure out this first. 별로, which means not really. And to make it as to be, 별로 이다. 이다 is need, needed, right? 별로 이다. And we want to take out 다 and add 던데요. 별로 이던데요? 별로 이던데요? Uncomfortable. So we take out 이. So 던데요. It's too difficult, right? Just remember, 던데요 for no bottom words. Okay? 별로 던데요? Easy, right? A. Have you used this phone before? This was really good, man. Try it. You should buy this. And you are saying, 별로 던데요? With a question mark. So, in the blanks, I have used it before. And it was not good. This whole thing is tondeo. Well, you can obviously say, I have used it. How would you say? Uh, right. 사용해 봤어요. I have, right? 사용해 봤어요. 근데 별로 던데요. How about this? I have used it, but. 사용해 봤는데. 사용해 봤는데. Say it. That's right. So 사용해 봤는데 별로던데요. You don't have to say 사용해 봤는데 part. Because you know what I am talking about. This phone is really good. Buy it. Really good. 별로던데요. I have used it. 사용해 봤는데. 별로던데요. Like this. All right. And with bottom letters, 이던데요. Use 이던데요. All right. <clears throat> hey, this book, um, I got this with um, 20 bucks. But you're my friend. So, as a friend, I'll just give you this $10 with. So, I'm telling you a lie. This was 10 bucks, but I'm telling you this was 20. And because you're my friend, I'll give you 10. Oh, you should give me $10, right? And you have checked this book in the bookstore and hey, what are you talking about? It was 20. Oh, sorry, it was 10. So do you understand this situation? Okay, so it's 20 bucks. I'll give you this with 10. Manwan, what do you think? <laughs> Just like that. So I have been to the bookstore. I went there and checked the price. 
I searched on the internet and then everywhere it sells with 10. You are a liar. You're, you're trying to scam to me, right? That's that. Do you understand? That's why. Then how would you say? The full, ten full sentence, I have checked it, but check the word 확인하다. Can you check the mic for me though? 확인하다. I have checked it, but 확인했는데. 해봤는데. 확인, I have 확인해봤는데. It was ten dollars. 만 원. 만 That's right. 확인해봤는데 만 원이던데요. All right. Hey, Derek. This is a hundred dollars. 십만 원이에요. 줄게요. 만 원이던데요. 만 원이던데요. 이던데요. Focus, okay. 만 원이던데요. Should be like a question mark. What are you talking about? It's ten. All right. With other words, let's practice. 성실하다. We think this as a word, um, as a word. Diligent. Work hard. Never get late, right? So, 성실하다. I'm telling you, I'm talking to you about this guy because I don't like this guy. Hey, he's always late. He's really, he doesn't know what he's doing at work. What do you think? What do you think? 성실하던데요. Don't change anything. So, just take out ta, that's it. How easy is that? 성실하던데요? 성실하던데요? So, in the blank, there is a meaning saying like, I have worked with him, but he's, he's a hard worker. I have seen him working hard. I have, I have been working with him for a long time. And he's diligent. He's a diligent young man. 성실하던데요? Like this. Understood? So I'm telling you again. 그 사람은 맨날 지각해요. 지각하고 일도 못 해요. 성실하던데요? 그래요? Is it like that? Understood? All right. How about this about this product? This computer. This is a computer, okay? Hey, this computer? Not good. Don't buy it. 이 컴퓨터는 진짜 느려요. 안 좋아요. 사지 마세요. What would you say? 좋던데요. Right. 좋던데요. So in the blank, I have used it, but how would you say? Uh, I have used it, but uh, 사용해 봤는데 It was good. 좋던데요. Right. 사용해 봤는데 좋던데요? Question mark. So, for practicing, uh, it's, it would be a good practice if you just keep saying, I have used it, but it was something. I have uh, done this, but blah, blah. It would be a good practice if you can't really understand this. So, 사용해 봤는데 좋던데요? When you get used to it, then just get rid of this blank part and then say, oh, 좋던데요? Hey, Derek, this is really expensive. What's wrong with this country? It's so expensive. Yeah. What? What are you talking about? I've been there and I saw it. I've seen it. It was like $1. Like that. All right. This one. Same conjugation. Just take out ta and add 던데요. All right. Hey, have you seen this guy? My friend, like um, Kevin, have you seen Kevin? In the blank, I have seen him and he was going home. How would you say? Right. 
집에 가던데요. I've seen him. 제가 봤는데, but 집에 가던데요. Right? Okay. Have you seen this guy, uh, Derek? I've seen him in the blank. I've seen him in the mall, and he was buying a jacket. Hey, have you seen Derek? Derek 봤어요? 어디 있어요? 백화점? 백화점에서. 백화점에서 That's right. 백화점에서 자켓을 사던데요. You have to memorize, you have to use this grammar with question mark. Otherwise, nobody will understand. You keep answering with 하던데요, 하던데요. No, 하던데요? Like that. Where's your friend? 친구 어디 있어요? Perfect. 집에 있던데요? Okay. 엄마는 지금 뭐 하고 계세요? That's right. But 엄마 should be respected. 주무시다. How would you say? 주무시던데요. Nice. 주무시던데요. 아빠는 뭐 하고 계세요? 뭐를요? 점심 드시던데요? Right, 점심을 드시던데요? Something like this. This is how you use this grammar, 던데요. And from now on, you're gonna hear uh, some sentences that is used with this grammar a lot because now you got it, you understood. So you can hear this more often and you can use this more, all right? So, hope you guys could use this tondeo in real life and, uh, you know, use it with question mark. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.